Hey guys, and welcome back. This is like my sixth time recording. Mostly because I keep on looking up at the TV, and I forgot to change some settings around. I was trying to record in 1080p, but it was making my videos really laggy, so I decided to go back down to 720p. My phone can handle 720p pretty well. 1080p can handle fine. I think it might have just been my... Um... It was because I was trying to use it with something else and I was doing it wrong. But this video is going to be all about the city tree. A review over it. Now, I said that I'd do that. I promised to. I promised you guys that I would. So I w went ahead and I'm going to start recording this right now. Now, benefit one. There's four benefits and it lasts for seven days. Pretty simple. And it costs, if you want to buy one, it costs nine bucks. So you're going to get nine bucks. And are you serious? They're gonna get nine. They're gonna get nine. Well, ten dollars worth of gems and a treaty. Now I bought the gems. The last gems that I bought, I bought without the twenty-five percent bonus. Oh wait, no, cause I okay, whatever. I don't even care. But anyways, benefit one: clear ten. Resource raids every day while using a city treaty to win a coral XP egg. Now, basically, what that is is that you get it. It probably says it on your screen if you're. It's only on Android though. It's only on Android, not Amazon or iPhone. Sorry, I had a burp. But it doesn't work on the other one. But if you buy a city treaty and then ten three-star resource raids victories before the treaty expires, you win a coral XP egg. Now, that gives you 7,500 XP for whatever you're putting in, putting it into, so just keep that in mind. And it's basically like the earn three stars and one to one, three, or five raids each. And then, basically, it's earn three stars and ten resource raids each, but it's for the treaty. I mean, it'll show you, it, it'll be on here, like, it'll be right above this. Buy hero treaty and use the higher hero things. I think it's above, but wherever it is. Now, benefit two: 50 build cooldown for one hour. I have zero uses left because I've already used it. But basically, what it does is it makes it so you can make it so whatever's building goes down by one hour, however long it takes to build. And you have 50 hours to do that. So basically, if you have a two-hour, if you have a two-day upgrade, you can just go in here, my victory statue. If I were to buy it, say I bought it, and then I go click on it, and then I can speed boost. And it says I used all of them, so I can come back again tomorrow. That also works with the Coral XP egg. Whatever, whatever it is, it resets the next day. And yeah, that's that for that. Okay, benefit three. Four daily free gold production boosts. Four use left. I haven't used mine yet. You get four of them. Well, it kind of said that. Didn't really have to say that to you guys, but what you have to do is you just go click on it, and usually it says you have to buy one or something like that. And you can just go over here, and you can just do it for every single one that you want to do it on. I'm just gonna do it in the high highest ones. And then it costs 17 gems for the rest of them. All right. This restarts every day because it says it does. Benefit four. Basically, this is you uh, earn more treasure chests. Like you've seen in most in all my videos that I've posted, except for the first one, I have extra treasure chests. I get five instead of three whenever I win. But if if you get a hundred percent, or actually, oh, it's a hundred percent victory. Well, if you get three stars, you get five chests. And I don't know how about what that works out if you get two chests. I think you only get two. If you only get two stars, you only get two chests. I think that's how that works. I haven't really... I've only gotten three stars, so I don't really know. But you get 100 battles for that. Like, it only, it only counts if you win. So then you have 100 battles to earn five chests. And then after that, you only get two chests. Like, after you... Battle 100 times, you only get two chests, because I had done that once, and it was kind of, it was it kind of made me mad. I mean, I was almost, I almost had, like, 
an XP card really high, and I was just grinding on it. And then next thing you know, it said I only got two. So I was kind of sad about that. But yeah, is it worth? Is it worth it to get <coughs> the treaty and gems over the more over 350 more gems? Think about it. Do you really need more gems? I mean, a tree will get you more than usually what you'd get from... I don't even know how I want to explain this. Like a coral, coral XP eggs, you just boost time. I think you would rather... I think it's more logical to get the treaty over the gems. <coughs> because there's those 20... Gosh dang, it's something in my throat. But... You get a boost. Well, not really a boost, but you get a bonus from gems, and that's 350. But that's an entire like. That's like an another. That's another. Um, that's another three times. But you can. You can if you don't get anything good out of it. Then what's the what's the use? Like seriously, because I mean you're gonna get seven coral XP eggs if you're on every day and attack ten times, and that's worth. One coral XP egg is worth like four. Is uh, is worth uh four epics. So basically, you're kind of eh. I would just go for the anyway instead. <coughs> Gosh. Well, I think that's gonna be it for this video. If you guys did enjoy, please leave a like and subscribe. And as always. Have a nice day.